covered members. Well, Shriners Hospital for Children has been changing the lives of children for decades. So today is our day of giving to lift the place that has done so much for so many. And you can certainly help by calling the number that you see scrolling at the bottom of your screen. Our Steve Harris joins us live this morning. He's here to explain just how your donations can help kids. Steve. Yes, and I'll tell you what, my favorite thing right here, you, Madeline, and you know, you guys know, first story I ever did with Shriners was with you. And it was kind of fun because we were doing something about, you were showing kids how to braid their hair, how to uh, jump rope. Tell me a little bit about that. Yes, so I, because of Shriners Hostels for Children, I am able to adapt to my everyday life and I actually speak to schools about disability awareness and I love to share the message that we all do things really unique and in different ways and so I teach others how to braid their hair um, with one arm or show, show kids or how I paint my nails and weight lift and do all the wonderful things in my daily life. Now, the, you're going to be an occupational therapist. Yes. How did your time with Shriners influence what you want to do? Yes. So. The wonderful thing about our occupational therapy department here is they have a camp now called Shrine Ability. It was called Hand Camp, and it's a camp for kids with upper limb differences. And what's really cool is that all the counselors and campers have upper limb differences. And so I got the opportunity to go back as a counselor, and I got to teach others with one arm how to do um, putting your hair in a ponytail and painting your nails. And I'll never forget the one moment where I taught this girl how to paint her nails with one arm, and it completely influenced my career. And I can't wait to help others be able to do what they want to do, need to do, and, and have to do to be successful. And stories like that. If you if you had to tell donors in one thing today, what would you say? Shriners, it's not just a normal hospital system. Shriners gave me the confidence that I have today, and they gave me the ability to share my message and continue to inspire kids for, for the future. Sorry, I got like a flash in my eye from something there. Oh, what do you have here? <laughs> I just recently got engaged. <laughs> <laughs> and I asked her if I could say that, and she said I could. So there yes. you go. <laughs> How about that? And graduating in December? Yes, I will graduate in December, and I can't wait to be an occupation therapist. Very, very good. So listen, you heard the story. You can help Shriners help kids. Call to donate 314-692-6448. Phones are open now. You can do that. The clowns are behind me. Madeline's here with me. What do you think, guys? Oh, Madeline, first of all, can you tell her congratulations? I don't think she can hear us, but like... This, congratulations this, from Claire. Yes. And Steve doesn't miss a thing. No. <laughs> those, those eagle eyes of his, <laughs> very, very sharp yeah. at 6.51 a.m. Yes, it's awesome <laughs> out there. Yeah, truly right there is a classic example of just a, a family environment, a yeah. family atmosphere. They go they go above and beyond for, for children around the world. Yeah, so. Such great work for such a long time as well. Oh, yeah, and if you can, every little bit count so help us out throughout the day and help us spread the word as well well a popular breakfast spot 